Welcome back to Improvision Entertainment. My name is Hunterman, and this is more of Cult of the Lamb. We're picking up right where we left off. Everybody has decided to sleep. I'm going to make their beds. We are on day four. Hey, you guys can do that. I'll make food. How you doing, everybody? Hi, Gaffer. What's up? Leader, I am famished. I fear I've become naught but skin and bones. I beg of you. Is there anything to eat? Working on it. Meaty broth. Meaty broth sounds good. How many do I get to create? I don't know. Do I need to make five bowls? I assume I have to make five bowls. Everybody get a bowl? There you go. There you go, guys. Uh, collect reward from Gaffer. What's up, Gaffer? Wow, you did it! Truly, you are without flaw. I am great. I am grateful, le great leader. Wait, what? Quest complete. Let's see what everybody else is thinking. Oh. Not everybody else just has a interact dialogue? Okay. Plant a berry seed. Plant berry bush. Okay. Uh, Gaffer, what are you doing? I think I already have somebody else collecting wood, so... Oh! Well, I don't, I don't have anybody to teach how to farm? So I gotta farm. That probably comes later. Um, I'm sorry, did you just create fertilizer? Wow, you're having a fit. Unsanitary conditions at your cult will cause your followers to become sick. If a follower becomes sick, assign them to bed rest or they could die. Resting will allow them to recover, s slowly recover. Poop, vomit, and dead bodies cause illness to spread quickly through your cult. Cleaning a mess and burying bodies will prevent spread of illness. Well, clearly we need some sort of outhouse. Vari, are you ill? Are you okay? Alright. We got any more of that around? A lot of people just ate. Yep, there's one. Okay. Um... Turn to the old faith, collect bones, perform any ritual in your temple. I... I'm gonna do a quick run of the land, make sure there's no poopage hiding. Up, up, up. Fertilizer. I'm sorry, fertilizer. Eat, poop, and pray. I mean that's what we got right now. It's a it's a very it's a it's a beginning cult. 
Alright, let's see if we can not get hurt this time. I'm sorry, what is this? Oh, followers deposit there. Yeah, yeah, I know. Okay, third run out. Let's see what weapon we get. The oh, the thing is around the ring of the door, actually. I didn't notice that before. Oh, uh, for everybody watching, I've turned off Bloom, <laughs> which is usually a culprit for uh, frame rate drops. Bane Dagger. Chance of poisoning enemies when attacking, or... Tor tor torch of Turturra. Convoke a violent eruption of powerful tentacles? <laughs> I mean, tentacles sound cool, but like... Dagger. Dagger, right? I got it. Now I'm, I've moved from a slow weapon to a fast weapon. Oh, I'm sorry. Do I get both of these? Oh, okay. Didn't realize. Whoa, Tenna killed. And I got bones! Hey! Alright, so I, I don't think I could have gotten bones before, and now I'm getting bones. I don't know what that attack was doing. Well, I'm getting bones pretty reliably. Hey, stone! Now I feel like it has begun. Ah, I've been hit. That does not aim like you'd think. I assume those bombs are now deactivated? Yes. Damn, but I got hurt, though. Daggers are gonna get me in trouble. Uh, left or down? Let's try left. I'm getting sloppy. Greenheart? What's Greenheart? I don't know what Greenheart was. Let's go the other way and see if it was a card. That's how this has been rocking out so far. Yep, card. Tell me, Lamb, do you believe in destiny? Or do you believe destiny is immutable? Um, Divine Curse. Curses consume 25% per less, less fervor, or overall weapon damage increased by 1.2. Um, I've got a big cast. Let's do the fervor thing. I got big tentacles this time. Blades are getting me messed up, though. Let's rock. What is this? Acquired stone flag? A stone pillar to raise your flag? Huh. Do I get to make a flag? Moving on. Okay. Is that a person? Is that a shop? What is that? Oh, but we want more followers, right? Well, we gotta check out question marks, though. I've never... I don't know what that is. Ah, I want a new follower, but what is this? Oh, hello, giant kitty. Welcome, y'all. Wow. 
I love your accent. Fornius. Oh, for a life of sensations of the heart rather than thoughts. Choose a follower form. Choose a blueprint. Oh, a blueprint would be pretty good. Buy Ambrosia. Increase curse attack damage by 1.25. Or stone fragment. Are these all money or... Well, let's get a follower form. Bunny follower form. That one costs money, which I don't have. Woe well, betide, thou not has not coin hearts break. What? Oh. Sorry, I was trying to see if I could steal your money. Full heart? You have full hearts, though. Wait, but two shops back to back? Are you a caterpillar? You are. Who mm, for your soul? Your undying soul. Uh, I think we want meat. Delicious and joy, traveler. My bad. I'm just trying to hit the bush. All right, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, calm down. I will take more fishes. Uh, a fight with an eye? No. I can still hear them on the screen, make it stop. Hi, I'm gonna steal your devotion. I'm gonna kick all your asses. I wasn't even paying attention. I got a box full of spiders. Creepy. Uh, down or right? Let's go right. Wait, what? Heck it. So it is true the red crown sits upon the brow of another. But how? We did everything we could to- It matters not. We need not bother Shamura with this de- With- Yeah, with this. Deal with it, brother. As you command, my sister. Taking poison damage. For the bone god. Hmm. But what was the other way? Oh, I guess I should start paying attention to the things on the ceiling. Rabbit foot. Increased chance to spawn better chests or. Diseased heart damages everything on screen when hit. Uh, better chess. Uh, 
I don't know if I got a lot of chests yet. That'd be a better card to pull earlier, but... Hello? Surely I can get stone from these statues. I feel like a Metal Gear Solid 5 right now. Flaming Shot 2. Um, I like the tentacle thing. Is that more powerful than what I got? Mm, doesn't say it is. There be bones in them there, grass. I like that these runs don't seem like they're overly long. Free card? Shield of Faith. When attacked, 10% chance of negating damage. Alright, moving on. I haven't seen any frame rate drops in a while, so I'm going to say that everything was bloom, but we'll see how it works out. Moving towards the boss. Stealing your devotion! And your stone! Oh, hi. Are we all but players in this game of chance? Yes, a little bit. A heart vow or reveal the map? Why would I need to reveal the map? Can't I just go everywhere? I guess an extra heart. Hold on, I missed some grass. Got your meat! Bane Axe 2. Chance of poisoning enemies when attacking. Oh, I go from super fast to slow. Um, That's a big damage increase. Yeah, Bane Axe. Bane Axe sounds good. Gotta make my hits count more. I did like the daggers, though. And then all the uh, bombs become disarmed. Alright. Oh, my little indicator has like the Roman numerals next to them for what level of... I almost ran into stuff. Oh, what's that? Hey, Flower Arch! Oh, it requires grass. I got plenty of that. Neat! Moving on. Barbados. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I think I can get two hits. Uh -huh. 
And then a third hit. I think I missed. Stay poisoned. Nice. Excuse me, let's just get rid of these bones. What are you? You're neat. Alright, well. Maybe we'll get back to town and maybe we'll have somebody on stream pick. Ooh. Skull necklace. Follower will live an unnaturally long life, double what they usually be expected. Interesting. Lots of money and bones. Alright, we just gotta perform a ritual at our temple and we should be good to go. I can't take those stones. Alright. Next run is apparently mega boss fight. Like actual boss as opposed to mid boss. I guess we we'll return to the cult, everybody. I think that was a good run. I think I got hurt in the first notch, but I didn't get hurt against the boss. Or did I? Did I get hurt against the No, no, no. No damage from boss with 20% on your items. Nice. Lots of... lots of stuff. Lots of collections. Oh, hey, dude. Do not mis make the mistake of becoming the servant to of your followers. They are for you to use to your advantage. Their faith is a resource. Spend it as you would gold, for you can always regain their trust with a well-placed gesture of kindness. Let it empower you. Let it give you license to do unspeakable things. Bend them to your will. I grant you the power to read their feeble little minds. Excuse me? Read minds. Follower command unlocked. Interact with followers to read their thoughts as well as see how hungry they are or tired they are. I guess we're declaring a new doctrine. You declared a doctrine which has granted you the follower action, the follow, the new follower action. Blah. When interacting with followers, this action will be available to you. Well, I mean, if I can read their thoughts, I can make them happier, right? By doing what they want. Earth Ender. <laughs> I like it. Oh, what's up, Alex? Whoa, angry bug face. What is happening? My little sister is shaken. I can see through your lies. I'm sorry, my faith is shaken. Why did I say my little sister? What the fuck is wrong with me? My faith is shaken. I can see through your lies. You are a fraud, and I must tell the others. Dissenter. A follower has begun dissenting against you. This happens when the cult's faith is too low. A traitor is spreading falsehoods about you. Other followers may be led astray. Re-educate them or put them in prison to bring them back to loving embrace of the cult. Or just sacrifice them. You make the rules, after all. Uh, re-educate? Why is everybody starving? Holy crap! Uh, cook button. Do I have the knowledge to make a prison? Oh, hey! Divine Inspiration Unlocked! Oh. Uh, what's- hey, what are you thinking, Gaffer? Feel great after a hearty meal. Leader did a quest, I'm so honored the leader quested on my behalf. And I had a great conversation with fellow cult member. 
Uh, been a member for five days, age 29. Okay, so I can go to the next level. Detected a few drop frames. Upgrade temple and shrine. Collect more devotion and allow more followers to pray. Requires tier 2 unlock. Oh, I have to go up this way. Shelter? Wait, hold on. What is this? Requires tier 2 to unlock. Wait, do I have to unlock... How do I unlock tier 2? Oh, it says 3 or 4. I thought it said 2 before. Um... We might need a body pit. Very dead followers of simple pits. Avoids rotting corpses. Alright. Then we're tier 2. We don't have any more divine inspiration. Um, our faith is low, so I should perform a... Oh, wait, I have to perform a ritual, right? Alright, this will cost that amount of stuff, and we will dance! Everything is fine. Crosser of Thresholds. Did I want a sermon first? Uh, I guess I'm done. Indoctrinating followers is well and good, but there is so much more you can take from them. Give them gifts, complete quests, and perform blessings for them, and you will increase their loyalty to you. Once they are totally loyal to you, they will give you everything they own. Watch as I show you, follower. Come back in here. What? What'd you just do? Follower loyalty. Increase the follower's loyalty to level them up, and they will reward you with devotion and commandment stone fragment. Each time a follower levels up, they will generate additional devotion. Win at a sermon or worshipping at the shrine. So be sure to cultivate their loyalty. To increase their loyalty, you can give a follower a blessing once each day when you interact with them. You can also give them gifts, complete quests for them, perform sermons, and many other actions. The more loyal your followers you have, the stronger you'll become. I have much to teach you, but I am old and grow weary. Visit me at my home, and I will show you how to harness the true power of the Red Crown. I'm sorry, there's a world map? I can now go to Lonely Shack. Neat. Re-educate or kill the Dissenter. Uh, we will not be killing the Dissenter. Your thoughts are... Faith in the cult is too low, I need to be re-educated, I might leave. Re-educate to center. Hmm. Uh... Can I give you a blessing? Uh, I re-educated today. Okay. See the thoughts of the follower. How do I give them a blessing? Oh, there it is. Wow, that's a big notch. Hey, Alex, I need to give you. Oh, I can't. I can't. Oh, I can't command you until you're re-educated. All right, noted. Gaffer, yeah, your turn. Give blessing. <laughs> Ding, baby. Kato. Give blessing. 
Did you have another window thing? Hey Gaffer, uh, because you were here in Euro Truck Simulator the other night for like seven hours or something, uh, I'm gonna increase your life expectancy. Have a gift. There you go. Are my berries dying or something? Oh wait. Is the bush too close to other things? Is that what's happened? Oh, what was that about needing fertilizer? Oh, add fertilizer. <laughs> you are welcome. It's the least I can do. It's not exactly like, you know, a real life super gift, but... Okay, hold on. So I've blessed everybody, I think, except for Alex, who can't be blessed right now. Did I, did I bless Jack? I did. Build an outhouse so I can poop in peace? Oh man, I would like to do that. Gaffer's over here pooping in peace. Believe me, outhouse is a priority. I don't know why we gotta research that. Everybody should have one. At least they're pooping on the outskirts of town. Well, it's not a town yet. Okay, everything seems to be in good working order. We need to... Uh... Go to the next look. Travel? Uh, Lonely Shack. Oh, I can't, like, attack while I'm here, so... Oh, what was that other place? Rato says, I must thank you. By relieving me of my duties, you have granted me what I desire most. Peace. Now I've taught you everything you need to know. I can pass my days playing Knucklebones. I have friends on their way to join me for a game or two as we speak. A rowdy bunch, to be sure, but now I am retired, I am free to enjoy myself. What is... what is that? What is... oh, uh... My bad. Wait, so what's over here? Oh, it can pick berries. I'm sure you won't mind. Oh wait, that's that's not a house, that's an altar. Okay, we're looking good there. I don't think I passed any bushes on the way in. There's a gift in the top left. You discovered my humble cottage. Be careful you don't make the same mistakes I did or you'll end up in a place just like this. What mistakes did you make? Now perhaps a game of knuckle bones. You don't know it? Why it's simple. Step up to the table and I will show you. Okay, what's this? It acquired a big gift. A gift to raise the loyalty of a follower. Alright, when I re-educate Alex, I'll give that to him. That makes sense, right? What is knuckle bones? Difficulty... 5%. A dice game? How to play. Your score is calculated by adding your all your dice together. When dice of the same number are placed in the same column, multiply the v v wait, multiply their value. So 6 times 6 is 36. Uh, destroy your opponent's dice by matching yours to theirs. Okay, I think I understand. I like dice games. What is this? 
got a four. I've got a two. A five. I'm gonna start from the top and go down, or middle and go down. Four. So if I put this four here, that eliminates their four. Interesting. Uh, that eliminates their three. But now I'll be stuck if I put another thing in that column that isn't a duplicate. Wait. How does... One and one... One times one is one. That should be eight. So, wait, is it... Du it's doubling. It's doubling, though. It's gotta be doubling. So it should be two and two and six is ten. That's actually good for me if I get another six. Why wouldn't you put that there to get rid of my existing... Alright, we're gonna go big money, big money. One, shit. Alright. 64 to 23, though. I like that? What do I win? Game of chance. By the one below, you are natural. Here, you've earned yourself a prize. Ooh. Tarot card. Gain an extra heart. The hearts, too. Neat. <laughs> now you've had a taste of the game. Care to wager some coin? Yes, but episode's running a little bit long. So for anybody who's watching later on YouTube, I want to thank you for watching. This has been Cult of the Lamb, presented by Improvision Entertainment. I've been Huntermun, and I will see you in the future.